Hi, I'm Futong Chang of Chang Concrete, and welcome to the Tions Tea Shop in Berkeley, California. I'm here to talk about good design and the relationship of decorative concrete to good design. Now, any project should start and end with good design. When we consider durability, that is also an aspect of design because concrete has its strengths and its weaknesses. So here in the tea bar, for example, we have an area where the actual ritual of pouring water and warming cups and things like that take place. And so I designed in a copper plate to really take the initial punishment of that hot water and that constant erosion quality of the water. But it drains itself down into a hidden uh, uh, conduit, if you will, that takes, a, takes the water away to the drain. And in this area, we decided it'd be best to, to polish the concrete, to get the aggregate out, so that if there are little any aberrations uh, anywhere, it doesn't show as much. So that's an aspect you need to know. Sometimes we have, for instance, on the shelving system, a very smooth uh, finish, what we call our geocrete finish. And uh, perhaps on the connoisseur's display, we also have very, very smooth finish, unpolished, almost stone-like look. But here, a lot of exposed aggregate because it shows wear less. Now, some people might say, well, is concrete really durable in a commercial application? Well, absolutely. In back of me, I have a countertop which was formerly a display for a large uh, refrigeration and uh, stove manufacturer. I had a display out in the um, kitchen and bath convention. And this went for 10 years, was traveling around the country at various shows, and we recycled it for the tea shop because it was still in good shape. And there it is, it's been here for five, six years, and uh, it's doing fabulously. Now this sink countertop here, which was recycled basically from uh, exhibits, uh, you'll see that there's slight areas of wear, and the kind of wear is a kind of an erosive wear, where the cream layer has kind of started to etch away a little bit. But that notwithstanding, you can see the rest of the piece. It's held up remarkably well for being a piece that's over 10 years old in a commercial environment, being moved around a lot. So you need to know what aspects of the concrete work well with your situation. And in this situation, which is a general cleanup, it's not scrubbing out dishes every day, it's a tea shop. This is a perfect application for that where the wear quotient of the cream layer is not so great that it can't be used in this situation. There's other situations where I would suggest maybe lining it with tile or lining it with stainless steel or copper or something like that because in those situations where you're gonna have a lot of use, a lot of constant use, that wear factor might come into play here and it'll get a little bit grainy too fast. So really take a look at what your application is before you decide you're gonna use concrete in exactly that spot. And remember, every good project begins and ends with good design. This is Futong Chang. Thank you.